when you think about the Atlanta restaurant scene, there are very few restaurants that have been around for a decade. How do you all plan to build in longevity? Because come on, guys, you all have been here long enough, you know. Restaurants open up and close, like people change underwear. Yeah. Um, you know, I think one thing we have going for us in terms of longevity is we, we, we have a very good team. And our, our retention for restaurants is very good. So to keep things going, you just got to not give up. I think tenacity is something that my mother, Betty, in part on me, Aaron has it in spades. There's been a lot of times Aaron has been met with challenges and the business and Aaron's risen up to the occasion and, and so is the team, right? Like going, making it through COVID and even getting the restaurant off the ground was super hard. Um, we also have a commitment to our core values and standards, which I think is, um, you know, Michelin star, no Michelin star, like our goal is to go in there and provide a safe environment for people to really dive into their own creativity and become the best version of themselves. And like we like to nurture not just people's like um, practical skills as far as their jobs go, but also like all their human aspects. We, we try like, to try not just chefs, but also good good human beings. Yeah, like good like people, we, right? We that, believe in that. And yeah. I think that that will carry, yeah. that's more important than food. We're, pro, we're big proponents of, of if, you're, if you lead a good life outside of work, it'll, you'll lead a good life inside of work kind of type deal. So, you know, not that everyone's perfect outside of work, but it's also like, well, what are you doing to try to be better? And, and can we be part of that journey and help you if we can? Mm -hmm.